up YouTubers, it's Brandon B aka Blaze here, and it's time for another movie review. So I just went to the movies today, and I just saw the movie called Det uh, Detroit, which is about the riots and uh, a couple of like murders or investigations that happened in 1967. Um, the riots happened, um, also the murders and the investigations took place at this hotel um, in 1967 also. Um, about just different things that happened between uh, different groups of people and the police and police brutality. Um, it was such a powerful drama film. Um, it was about like two hours and 30 minute long movie, super long movie. Um, the, there was a lot of good actors in it. Um, two of them that are pretty famous, which is like Will Port Porter, who is that nerdy kid from We're the Millers. He did really good in the movie. He was one of the police officers and investigated with the murders and the police brutality. Um, also, the guy who played Finn um, in Star Wars The Force Awakens was also in the movie as one of the main uh, persons in the movie that had to do with the hotel. Um, but he was one of the security guards that was actually helping the National Guard. Um, it also had the guy, Anthony Mackie, who played Falcon in the Avengers as one of the guys who comes back from the war, um, who was just staying at the hotel. Um, but it was just such a powerful film that, uh, based on a true story about really happened. Uh, the director of this film, I think, did a really good job um, because she actually shows like really good like documentations of everything that happened because she, the lady that made this movie made the movie called The Hurt Locker and Zero Dark Thirty. Um, I would probably give this movie probably a 8 out of 10 um, because it had a powerful like beginning, middle, and end. Um, there's a lot of drama, a lot of action, uh, a couple of actually jump scares in the movie too, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, but the only reason why I gave it that also is because it was a really, really long movie, but I actually do like sometimes when movies are long because it keeps me entertained. Um, but that's, that's all I have for this movie for the review. Um, also, in the comments below, um, you guys should put down what you guys uh, like for movies or what your favorite uh, movies are so that I could watch those and start doing reviews on like movies that are already out on DVD. Um, and if you guys have any suggestions, you guys could put uh, uh, re things I should do for like movies for reviews. Um, also, I'm actually going to be starting uh, food reviews also coming up soon. So please like my videos. Please subscribe. Thank you.